Welcome back to Warlock Gamer Kadash. I am playing Super Flight today. I just came across this game uh, in the Steam library. Saw that it was two ninety nine and thought, hey, that's a pretty decent sale. This looks like an interesting game based off the picture of it. Let's see what it is. Turns out it wasn't on sale. It was just this is just the actual, that was just the actual price of the game, and it looks kind of fun and relaxing. So I'm gonna give it a play. So the point of this game is you are one of these like gliding people. Uh, oh god. Uh, oh god. Oh god. Uh, Jesus. Uh, it's like. It's like those, uh, oh, Jesus! Oh my gosh! Okay, okay, uh, let's try that again. Uh, yeah, and so, basically you fly close to the walls to get points, and flying through holes and stuff gets you more points. Got it. It's like those people that wear, that wear those special suits, you know? And they just glide through the air. Oh gosh, uh, go up, go up, go up. Ah, uh, there we go, there we go. Ooh! That's cool. This and it just it just seemed like a cool game to play. Oh, okay, that paused it somehow. Okay. And it's just whoa, whoa, what's going on? Whoa. Okay. Blackout achievement. Jeez. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Whoa. Let's dive bomb. Let's dive bomb. Yeah. Woo. Up yours. Oh, jeez. Okay, let's get through here. Oh, crash. This is cool. Yeah, it just seemed like a fun game to play based off the, the trailer that I saw. Well, let's try to get through here. Oh, cl close one. Okay. Alright, let's try seeing if we can squeeze through there. Ooh, what's that purple thing? I saw it in the trailer, but I don't know what it do I don't know what it does. Oh, we're gonna black out again. And sha. All right. Oh, let's go through here. Let's go through here. We. Blocky, unimpressive graphics, but it's very environmentally satisfying. And this is just this is oh Jesus. It's just cool. Ah, so. I just got back from a co-worker's uh, party. I figured, uh... I almost called it a housewarming party. You know, it was a Friendsgiving party. That's right. Woo! Yeah, you know, I just had some good food. Uh, I'm not the best chef out there, so I just ordered two Domino's pizzas. And, uh... I'm not sure if it... Well, let's try that again. Let's try to get through this hole. And ooh, oh, that'd be a lot of points if I got through that. I bet. Oh, okay. One more try. One more try. We're gonna get it. We're gonna get it. Going through this hole. Going through the hole. Going through this small hole. There we go. I'm sure. I'm sure. Uh, I might make it. That's what she said. Joke in the editing process. <laughs> yeah. Not sure if anyone really ate the pizzas at all, but hey, there, there. If anyone wants them. It was a good time, though, hanging out with co-workers and meeting people I'd never met before and seeing people that I've only met once before. Whoa! Is there a way you can slow- Whoa! Okay, hitting- hitting- yeah, hitting spacebar restarts everything. Huh. Ooh, let's go up- oh, oh, whoa, whoa, oh. So, my wife is currently down for the count with a stomach bug of some kind. So, uh, yeah. Very worried I might be getting sick myself. Whoa! I just hope not. I know you. You can't really give good massages if you're, uh, if you're sick. But from her perspective, you can't really watch children very well if you're sick. That being like she, she worked, my wife works in daycare. So that's why I say that it's not it's not for watching her own child, which will also be difficult as well. But thankfully, her mom should be coming over tomorrow to help out with all of that. Oh, let's squeeze through. 
zoom, zoom, woo! Lots of points. And let's, woo, we're doing a spiral. Woo. All right. Whoa! You know, I take it back. The visuals. Wait, I didn't really say anything bad about the visuals except that they were blocky. But it's. Oh god, oh god! Still cool. Let's see if I can do this again. Getting through. Ah. Yeah, I made a Twitter post saying that I was going to play uh, either Contrast or Road Redemption. But then I played this instead. It just seemed like a fun idea. You know, even if this if this is just the one episode thing, which it very likely will be, I don't see this becoming any kind of a series. In fact, I'm thinking about abandoning uh, Stardew Valley Stardew Valley altogether, because I really don't know where to go with that. I mean, I can, fl I can see playing it on my own, but doing it for a show, I really don't know. I never really watched anyone play through it, so I don't really see how it can be done. Maybe that's what I should do, but then I would just expo uh, spoil the experience for myself. Let's see if I can find a new map. I'm gonna just fly out, fly out, just fly out into the unknown. Ooh, oh, jeez. Okay, we got a, we got ourselves a uh, purpley looking darker place. Well, clouds. Are there are clouds. Can I fly into the clouds, or is that too far out? If it's not too far up, oh, yeah, that's gonna be too far out. Well, let's see the new map. Oh, I virtually identical, but a little brighter. Ooh, oh, ow, that hurts. Why would you fly into that? I'm gonna do it again. Whoa! Okay, okay. Let's see if I can make that happen again. Nope. <laughs> oh, uh, didn't mean to do that again. <sighs> but yeah, I, uh, yeah, I have a Twitter account now. I mean, I still have virtually nobody watching me right now, so it doesn't really matter, but if anyone is interested, yes, I am... Uh, oh, portal! Whoa, Jesus. Ah! Ah! Okay, let's, let's live dangerously. Oh god, oh god! I didn't mean to fly down that way. Whoop. There we go again. This environment reminds me of something. I'm reminded of like the Rocky Mountain, well, not the rock, Rocky Mountain, uh, the sort of mountainous desert uh, stage from Dragon Ball Z, uh, Dragon Ball Budokai 3. Dragon Ball, Dragon Ball Z Budokai? Or was it Dragon Ball Budokai? Either way, it was the third one. Oh, oh, whoa, 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 Jesus, oh gosh, oh, oh, uh, didn't want to save a map, but yeah, you can, s if you see a map that you like in this game, you can save it and go back to it again, you know, this game really doesn't have much of an objective except for points, you know, and that just makes it simple, and because they kept the objective simple, the graphics low poly, just these blocky shapes, and the simple the simple task of just of just gliding around I appreciate that a lot Woo! we're gonna do a dive bomb guys and girls whoa we're doing a dive bomb whoa here we go here we go we're gonna find the bottom we're gonna find the bottom we're going to reach it or we're we just going to black out yep we blacked out into another area and Pull up, pull up, pull up! Ooh. Ah, good times. Well, let's let's go through that portal. Yes, yes, yes! Yes! This is cool stuff. I am going to crash unintentionally. Ah. We'll fly through here. Whoa. <laughs> what what is, what's in the settings exactly? Uh, sensitivity. What is Zen mode? The flying monk. What? Does that? Hmm. 
What is Zen mode? Oh, it takes away the points. So if you just want to fly around with no discernible goal. Oh, okay. So if the points don't matter to you, just like whose line is it anyway, then Zen mode is the mode for you. So what else is in here? Uh, video? You got the video. Shadow distance and everything, motion blur. I don't know much about these terms very much. Wind. Oh, oh, it's the audio. Yeah, that's right. Let's we'll keep going. I mean, I'm running a little long, but this isn't a series, so I'll just I'll make it just a few minutes longer. Or if I can think of anything remotely interesting to talk about in the least bit. Um, you know, if I want to, I do want to. It is my hope to eventually one day gain an audience while I'm doing this. Because, you know, I really do want to entertain people. And for the entertainment process, you know, I'm going to need to... I want to know what people like. I mean, I've watched a lot of Let's Plays in my day. I like it when people are personable, but funny. I like to see reactions of people, which is why you probably won't see me doing many horror games until I have the courage to put a face cam on this thing. Which may happen one day if I get enough people watching me. And I love horror horror games, so I would like to play them. I mean, I haven't even I've only played like maybe ten minutes of Outlast 2 before I got before I started this whole channel. And I would like to continue it. But now that I'm playing things on this channel, I feel the need to save what I'm doing for potential episodes. If if they are entertaining enough. Like Star Dude Valley, I'm gonna take a break from that one for a while. But if not enough people found it interesting, then I'll just play it on my own and see what else I can do. Because I can see how it might not be entertaining for people to watch. Also, if anyone liked the whole Wikip random Wikipedia page thing, please let me know. I'll read more of those if you like. I don't know, I, I found it strangely entertaining to watch and edit it. So I'll do it again if you guys enjoyed it. I really hope you can hear me over this crazy wind. But uh, I have some other ideas to potentially make things interesting. I'll, I'll do them in time. I got a couple of series that I'm working on right now. Oh, oh! It's gonna take some time to get them up. Right now I'm trying to get all the January episodes, no not January, uh, December episodes up. I want to get them up so that I can focus on a couple of projects that I'm working on for this channel. And uh, I'll be I'll be announcing them on my Twitter account as as time progresses. And you know, with that, I think I'm going to end this episode. Thanks, thank you to everybody for watching, and I'll uh, I will see you next time. Bye bye.